tonight probably the last true patriot in America I stand here tonight perhaps even a martyr against tyranny and injustice because the fact is I am an American professional wrestler but because of my heritage, because of my background, because of who my ancestors were, I'm labeled, we're labeled terrorists. Terrorists. I'm a terrorist. Well, it must be true. It's got to be true because it's right here in black and white in a reputable source like the New York Post. Well, you don't believe me? Here it is. Terrorist wrestles after bombing. I'm a terrorist. We're terrorists. We wrestled after a bombing. Well, Mr. Don Kaplan, have you ever met this Don Kaplan? Have you ever spoke with this Don Kaplan? Have you ever called Don Kaplan on the phone? Well, I never have either. So if Don Kaplan of the New York Post has never met us, how does Don Kaplan know that we're terrorists? Don Kaplan also writes that Arabs in ski masks carried Davari out as a sacrifice last week. Arabs in ski masks. In ski masks. Exactly. In a ski, a ski mask. How does he know that they were Arabs? The point is, because of articles like this, because of the fear that the media has put in all of you people. I have been denied my God-given right to pursue the profession of my choice to pursue the American dream. I have been denied my basic rights as an American citizen. You know, as I look around this crowd, and I look at all these faces looking back at me in disgust, I think a lot of you people have forgotten what this country was founded on. I think all of you people have forgotten that your ancestors fought for their freedom. They gave their lives for their freedom, whether they be black, whether they be Irish American, Italian American, Jewish American, Asian Americans, they gave their lives for their freedoms. What's next, people? What's next? Because anytime anything goes wrong in this country, it's the Arabs. When a plane crashes, it's the Arabs. When a bomb goes off, it's the Arabs. The blackout two summers ago, it was the Arabs. Hurricane Dennis must be the Arabs. You people 
say what you want. Because I have a right to be in here. I have a right to say what I want. And what I'm going to say, my name is Mohammed Hassan. I am an Arab American, and I am very proud of my heritage. But as an American, my First Amendment rights have been trampled. And I stand here before all of you ashamed of my country. واسه همه کی هفته پیش نگاه کردیم ما رو تلویزیون شما دیری من از زمین که رفتم بالا هم رفتم اون پشت ولی شما ها بکرید دستا روی من دستای عرب بوده اصلا نمیفهمی کی هسته ولی شما بهتون میگن عرب هستیم ما عرب هستیم آدم بد هستیم ولی اگر یه دفعه یه دفعه یه سانیه به حرفای من گوش کن به حرفای محمد گوش کن میفهمی ما دوتا آمریکایی هستیم ما دوتا از آمریکا هستیم هم فقط شما دوتا میفهمین چی نوشتن همینجا همینجا